To other stories now, the trade and investment authorities are saying the country's export processing zones have brought investments worth billions of dollars into Nigeria's economy. The investments spanning three decades of the agency's existence are expected to continue to rise in the coming years as more of such facilities come into existence. Our correspondent, Lara Afolayo, tells us more in this report. The country's free trade zones as tools for driving GDP growth. So far, billions of dollars in investments have been attracted into the economy, while lots of direct and indirect jobs have been created. This week's program affords us an opportunity to examine the challenges and successes of SCZ projects across the continent and how they can be strengthened in our various climes. The free zone scheme in Nigeria has been able to record significant milestones. It has given birth to landmark infrastructure projects that have the potential to completely transform the local and regional business environment. Presently, NEPSA oversees affairs of 46 free trade zones, 44 of them private and two government owned. Those publicly owned are undergoing concession to the private sector. The agency is positive approvals for the establishment of special economic zones and free trade zones will add to benefits of successes already recorded. Improving cooperation among government agencies has really helped to engender smooth operations in the free zones. Some practical examples of this cooperation is the tripartite memorandum of understanding between the Federal Inland Revenue Service and both NEPSA and OGSA. This helps balance revenue mobilization drives with the desired outcomes of the scheme. The Nigerian Customs Service, a key stakeholder, recently accepted to implement the free zone concession regarding imports and exports by free zone enterprises into the customs area. Furthermore, the Central Bank of Nigeria is working on the guidelines for banking operations in our free zones. This document will serve as a regulatory instrument to guide the free trade zone offshore banking. NEBSA is positive that the African Continental Free Trade Area Agreement and the opportunities it offers will deepen existing efforts at further real sector GDP growth. Lara Folayo, TVC News, Abuja.